are at Aubert's du Premier for Summer Licious and this place is really nice. Really, really impressed with the, the location. It's so cute. Look at this. You know, very, very cute. Yeah. I've actually never ever been here. My family loves this place and um, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I'm with my intern. So they just brought us bread and it's hot and they don't serve it with butter, they serve it with artichoke dip. Which is interesting. That's so, good. so good. So good is usually pretty good. We're starting. She's starting the light. She has some crazy yummy stuff going after. And that's a green salad. Looks yummy. And I'm doing the melon gazpacho. And it's like not gazpacho, but there's almost a sweetness to it. I just have some melon that's coming in. Really, really good to eat. And then they've got fresh basil in here. Yeah, I don't like gazpacho normally. I'm in heaven right now. Main courses just came. Mine looks heavy. See how they cook the salmon? It's almost raw. I like that. And her, you're having the chicken paillard, which is chicken, and then on top in there there's cornichon, pickles, uh, what else? Tartar sauce, green beans. Proper French. I might need to have a bite. What do you think of your chicken? Because I have to say, I just had a bite, and it is delicious. It's very, very good. Um, yeah, it works so well together. Like the yeah, the, we were saying the crust. It's yeah. it's really light. It's not like chicken fingers. Yeah. Um, it's kind of flaky. Everything it just worked well. Yeah. Especially the sauce. So she doesn't eat anything. She's very, very picky. And she decided to, to get an internship at View the Vibe. <laughs> Funny. Yeah. And I'm having the salmon with the the wild, uh, well it's actually sh shiitake and oyster mushrooms. And then kind of like a thyme, basil, kind of like a pesto or a velouté. It's not really, it's not really 100% pesto. But it's it's tasty and it matches with the so the salmon is cooked medium rare which I really like and the mushrooms are just sautéed in olive oil so the flavors are simple but they're fresh they're really really good and yeah it's just good quality food so so I'm a little bit full for dessert but. They seem to have these yummy desserts. So this is hazelnut cake with banana and chocolate and ice cream. Very bad for me, but it's good for her. And this is a nougat, a, um, a sorbet, a nougat sorbet with some fresh strawberries. Dessert. Um, I might have an extra bite. It's really good. So we tried this, and we had a little bit of the banana with a little bit of the crunchy stuff, the cake, and the hazelnut ice cream. Because a chef in St. Martin once told me that you have to have a little bit of everything on the plate because when the chef creates something, that's the way it's meant to taste with all the flavors together. And this nougat kind of creamy sorbet, and then you combine it with the pistachios and the strawberries and the vanilla and the strawberry cream. Really, really tasty. Did you like? It's amazing. It's very French. It's actually very, very French. Yeah. yeah. I just realized this dessert tastes like a Toblerone. <laughs> so good. I like that one better. But I like, like this one better? Oh, yeah, really? well, I like the ice cream plus. I know that seems my favorite. But, uh, this is really good. I just don't like the cream as much. Yeah. It's, it's too creamy, but um, it still tastes really yeah, good. Yeah, because there's a ton of dried fruit and yeah. nuts, and, and then it's mixed into a cream. It's a bit, yeah. No matter. I'm good. Yeah. This was a very good summer-licious lunch, totally worth $25.